Hi guys and welcome back to my channel. Oh man, it has been a minute since I posted a YouTube video. Um, so I want to apologize. Life has been crazy, but I have been uh, doing my podcasts every two weeks and posting on Instagram. So I'm going to post links to my podcast, which is called Pixels and Planners, um, and also my Instagram in the description. So I apologize for the lack of uploads, but I promise I will uh, be uploading more. So I wanted to open this with you guys today. So, okay. I, I could not be more excited for that. Like, literally, I'm about to cry. Um, so, this is the Blackout Sticker Book from the Honey Bee Shop. This was released last year, I believe, in 2020, and I did not get it. I believe that this was a part of the Advent Calendar. And Shan from the Honey Bee Shop decided to... Uh, make more of them and there was a pre-order for this sticker book and I pre-ordered one of them a couple months ago and it just came in and I haven't flipped through it yet because I wanted to do it here with you guys because I, I know I'm gonna like geek out over this and I want to share this with you because it is so freaking gorgeous already just from the cover so before we get into it be sure to hit that subscribe button Thank you so much for 330 subscribers. I truly appreciate it. Uh, hit the like button, thumbs up if you enjoy it. Um, and yeah, let's just get into it. Okay, page one. Guys, I can't, I can't, I can't. I can't do this, I can't do this. Okay, like, okay. Can we just take a moment um, I don't even, like, honest, oh my god. I don't think I can use this. I feel like I need to hoard this for the, I, I'm gonna need about three more of these. I, okay, so first of all, it's matte paper. Like, matte, matte. And then you see the hollow, right? Like, um... D I, d I, I don't have, I don't, I, d I can't. I can't. We're only on page one and like, I can't. <sighs> I want to create stickers that make people as excited as I am right now. Because guys, I am literally tearing up. Do you see this? This is so me, I can't even like, oh. Oh my God, the fox. It uh, guys, like what? How am I supposed to do? Are you kidding me? I am, I am truly speak, like, I am speechless. I can't. The date covers. And these, oh my god, the tiny little sparkles. Look at them. Wow. I, uh, wow. I don't think I can use this. I think I need to hoard this for forever. Um, and you get two sets of date covers, or one set, I guess. That's awesome. I'm having a couple issues peeling them up, I will say. All right, there we go. We're good. Oh my God. I, like, I don't even know what to say. Oh my gracious. Okay, so we have our icon sheet, and this comes in every Honey Bee Shop sticker book. Um... But these matte black ones with the hollow are really hitting different. I, I, yeah. Um, so if you've seen my videos before where I unbox the um, Babe Box subscription, I always say that, you know, these icons are really nice, but there's only a few of them that I truly use. So I end up like 
giving them to other people, which is fine. You know, always like to share uh, stickers and happy mail, but this little video game controller um, and like the money with the coins and the pizza, I just, and this is perfect for birthdays. Like I, I'm just, I, 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 I can't, oh, oh my God. Oh my God. Oh my God. The bat, the bat bow checklist. Are you, Shan, I, Shan, I am, a, I'm, you're going to give me a heart attack. Look at, look at this. Are you kidding? These are die cut bat bow checklists. Are you serious? Okay. Uh, whoa. whoa, the hollow on this. Um, so like, you really think I'm supposed to use that and not hoard it? Cause I'm going to hoard that. You know what? I love this one so much. I'm going to make a bookmark out of it. So I, what I can do is I can peel this up and put it on like, um, a nice piece of cardstock and then just cut around the design and then laminate it or laminate it and then cut it, I guess, um, to make a bookmark. And if you leave enough paper over here, you can punch it. Uh, yeah, I'm definitely going to do that. Um, these little, so this is the Hobonichi page. These teeny little bat bow checklists are amazing. Um, and then the little box down here. And then this, I do not have a Hobonichi, but I use these stickers all the time. So use them in any player. Okay. I can <laughs> and I mean, I can't use these. Like they're just, they're too beautiful. Like one of my death before decaf guys, I can't. This is, like, if I could design a sticker book, like, this is everything I would want. Oh my god, the little ghosty. Look at him! And the rose, and the creepy but cute, I love. I have a lot of these in die cuts, because I did get the die cut pack last year. Like, off of Mercari or something. Um, I, like... Foldable coffin stickers with bat bows on the top. I quit. I, that's the last bit. I quit. Are you? All right. Just in case y'all don't know how a foldable sticker works, if you've never used one of these, because when I first got the babe box, I had no clue how to fold these. And hopefully I don't screw it up on camera and make myself look like an idiot. These over here are not foldable. Okay, so you will see, hopefully I can get it on camera, there is, there's little tiny perforated lines. So basically you want to see like where you're going to stick it down and then you can fold it this way. Okay, so like you would stick it down and I can stick it right here on the page like this and then you just want to fold over kind of like like an accordion, I guess. It's okay if you mess up. You can just kind of very carefully pull it apart. I just really want to line it up like perfect. It's kind of hard to do. Okay. So this is what would be on your paper. And then you have this. So it's foldable. So then you get, you can write on here, you can write here and on here. And this is really good if you want to write something like personal in here, like a little note to yourself and then cover it up when it's in your planner. Um, so yeah, I'm like, I honestly, this was beautiful online, but in person, I just can't express how much I love this. Like, Shan, this is one of the most beautiful things I've ever seen. And like, I don't, I don't want to use it. Like I want to use it, but I don't because like, look at it. I need to organize my sticker books. I have sticker books 
all over this house and in this planter cart. And I'm gonna do it with y'all right now, just the honeybee ones. We're gonna do a separate video of sticker organization because, okay, so yeah, we're gonna do like a whole separate video on sticker organization because I have stickers all over this house. I have stickers in this planter cart that are just like everywhere and I really wanna get them organized. But for my Babe Box and Honeybee Shop sticker books, I can just slide them right in here. So I like that it has a strap here. I usually keep, like the, I got this idea from Shan, um, the one that I'm like using on the strap and then put the other ones away. And I'm not putting these in any order. I used to have them in order of like when they released. Ain't nobody got time for that. Maybe in the future. Um, and just so you guys know, because you're probably used to me doing a Babe Box unboxing video, I did not get the September Babe Box. Um, I know everyone's freaking out about it and how beautiful it is, and I'm sure it is beautiful um, in person. Like, it's always prettier in person, and I thought it was pretty. It's just not really my style, and I wanted to take that money and use it toward other things. So, just so you know. But... There are definitely plenty of other unboxings here on YouTube and also on Instagram. This thing's getting thick now. She's thick. Okay, I think that's all my Honeybee Shop sticker books. So I have my new blackout one. This one I really use a lot. This is from Grace. Uh, the Disney one. Bare Necessities. I have literally used this whole front page. It only has like... I used... Yep, I got one left there. Got the icons. Some, some checklists. Yeah, I've, I've used the absolute crap out of this one. This one I absolutely love. Um, but it's not like my everyday vibe, so I don't use it a ton. This one I've used the crap out of, Crafty at Heart, Book Gazer. Maybe one day I'll do like a ranking Babe Boxes video for the Babe Boxes that I have. I think that'd be kind of cool. Let me know in the comments. I mean, you guys already know what number one is for me, if you've watched my channel before. But, and that sticker book is not in here because I literally use the entire thing. Um, this was super, super pretty, but obviously it's fall now. We ain't got no time for summer, but we will get back around to her next year. And then Pastel Dreams, I've used a lot. And then here in the back, I've just tucked away some sticker sheets and then a journaling card from Lights Planner Action. And I also have one in the front and a picture of me and my husband. So I hope you guys enjoyed that little flip through of the blackout sticker book as far as i know it is still in stock on the honeybee shops website if i had the money i would literally buy 10 of them and just hoard them for the rest of my life um because it is probably my favorite sticker book i've ever had in my life so i hope you guys enjoyed uh thanks for watching again be sure to subscribe check out my patreon um you can support the channel for as little as two dollars per month I have a sticker shop launching soon, so stay tuned um, and listen to my podcast, Pixels and Planners, uh, for updates on all things gaming and planning and just about me and what I got going on in my life. So thank you guys so much for uh, watching, and I promise I will be uploading more. <laughs> thank you to my subscribers. I appreciate you guys for being patient with me. Uh, definitely follow me over on Instagram. I try to update my stories over there every day. Um, and I try to post at least three or four times a week. So anyway, I'm gonna go hang it out here. Hope you guys have a great rest of your day and I will see you next time.